Good morning. I'm Dr. Jimenez, the proud principal of Newman Smith High School, where our mission is to graduate all scholars to be college, career, or military ready without remediation. Please join me for the Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Now join me for our pledge to the Texas flag. Honor the Texas flag. I pledge allegiance to thee. Texas, one state, under God, one and indivisible. And now for our moment of silence. Good morning, Newman Smith. I'm Dr. Jimenez, the proud principal of Newman Smith High School, where our mission is to graduate all scholars to be college, career, or military ready without remediation. Well, let's have a great Monday. I hope you had a restful weekend, and I hope that you are prepared to really focus on those grades. It's the second week of the second nine weeks, and remember to get credit in your class, which you need 26 to graduate. To get credit in your class, you have to have attendance and a passing grade of 70 or above, and those two things combined give you credit in that class. So make sure, scholars, you are working with your teachers and you are focused and concentrating on making great grades. Well, our SAT word of the day is capture. It has several different meanings. Capture can be to trap or take possession of, to successfully represent or imitate, to captivate, mesmerize, or to catch or seize. Capture is a verb. Here are, a, here are two examples. Your painting beautifully captures the ephemerality of life or the, the spy was captured by the enemy. So those are two examples of that verb, capture. That's our SAT word of the day. Well, scholars, we're super excited to have on the news with us today our foreign exchange student, Miriam. Miriam is from Tunisia, which is located in North Africa, and I've asked her to come and share her story and what she enjoys about Smith, but share a little bit about her home country. So Miriam, come on over. Hi everyone, uh, my name is Miriam Aglibi. I'm from Tunisia and I'm here on foreign exchange. I'm only gonna be here for a year and I'm so glad that they chose to put me in Newman Smith. Um, I just wanted to share a little bit about my country, my home country. Oh, let me help you hold this up, okay? <laughs> um, uh, Tunisia is a country located in North Africa, thank you. Um, and uh, we, uh, ha we border the Mediterranean Sea, Libya, and Algeria. Um, it's so random because and whenever I say Tunisia, people usually don't know where that is or they think it's Indonesia. Um, so just so you know, it's just a country located in North Africa. Um, what I love about Newman Smith and being here in general is how many things I get to be involved in because back home, I get to only go to school from eight to five every day, including Saturdays, actually. Wait, um, they have school on Saturday yes. in Tunisia? Yeah. Oh, yeah. scholars. <laughs> Yep. Count your lucky stars. Exactly, yeah. So um, I'm so excited that I get to only go to school for a limited time and then have time to take care of my extracurriculars and um, horn my other skills. And yeah, it's just been really nice being here. I'm so excited to get to be on the news and get to be part of so many clubs like robotics. Um, I get to be, be in ceramics. Um, I want to thank my all of my teachers for being so supportive, especially Mr. Cedillo. Um, Ms. Lopez, Ms. Leach, uh, Dr. Lee, thank you so much for making this experience such a wonderful one, and I can't wait to spend the rest of the year with you. So, Marian, before you go, tell us a little bit about what you're wearing, oh, your hat and your vest. Um, so, this is considered a traditional vest. Um, most girls at weddings um, will wear this over, like, a white dress, um, and I have my 
a kind of Logo Youth Exchange and Study shirt on, which is the shirt that we have to wear uh, in the airport so that people recognize us because we're a part of this a scholarship program that you get to participate in and then you just win a scholarship and you get to come. Um, you get picked among like, I think 5,000 people and you get to spend an exchange year here um, wow. with the host family. Um, and this is called Shesheya. And ma mainly men wear this. Um, you can find them on the street just wearing this while, you know, uh, having their hookah or their black coffee on the street. Awesome. Miriam, I'm so thankful that you are here. And I'm so thankful that you uh, that you love your country and you're sharing with us about the country of Tunisia. So of scholars, if you see Miriam in the hallway, say hello um, and welcome her to Newman Smith because that's what Trojans do. Well, we love you. We think you're great. Remember character counts and make it a great day or not. The choice is yours.